we'll get his argument from him when he returns, but we do have a couple other guests who have since joined. Uh, Ultimate Truth, you are the next to join. You are rather famous around these parts, but go ahead and introduce yourself and state what you believe. Hello. Camelot. Yes, sir. Welcome back. Uh, you uh, thank you back. Um, yes, my name is Ultimate Truth. Uh, so I'm a Muslim, of course. Uh, I'm like the disciples of Jesus who worship Allah alone, and I follow the Book of God alone. No other book, no man-made books, and uh, I believe the Bible is, but. A collection of a hadith, a collection of, of hearsays that was not sent to nobody. The Injil that Allah is talking about was sent to the Jews and they hiding it from themselves. So that the Quran was sent to mankind, to the old the Gentiles. And uh, that's it. If you okay. now. Uh, yeah, so I think that you heard the, the activity here. So can you give us a reason citing a specific Quran verse or surah as to why you trust the Quran? Yes, sir. I, I, I trust the Quran. Uh, you see, I, I, I know everybody have read the Quran now, Christians and atheists. And you see the wisdom in the Quran. You see the you and final verse like uh, like uh, God describing himself. You don't find that in the other books. God advising people what to do, how, how, to, how, how to be guided. You don't gonna find it. God showing that I, the way I created the world, I created this in so many days, I did this and I calculated this in four days to satisfy the needs of all. Think about this. If God says, I calculated the needs of humanity in four days, which Christians have tried to change into, I created the earth in four, or something in four days. When he said, I calculated your needs in four days. You, uh, people can't can even calculate the needs of, of their families for the next, for if, if they would ask you, hey, uh, Tadeus, how about you if God would have come to you right now, said, "Hey, uh, can you imagine how much money you will need for for you, for your family and your progenitor for the next hundred years?" That's it. Next hundred years. Tell me how much money you need. You don't know. You don't know how the economy is gonna go. You don't know how 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 things gonna change. God calculated the air we need, the food we need, the water we need, everything we need in four days. So now, uh, is, is that the verse? Assalamu wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. The series continues. They all will choke. They all choking. And they can't handle the truth. Same verse, 1746. If you preach your Lord, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, using only the Quran, they will run like donkeys. Watch them run. It's Christian's turn to choke. Sorry, for the purposes of this activity, is that the verse that you want to go with? And if so, what no. verse is that? Uh, no, I want to go with, with uh, reason. Uh, so you want me to just pinpoint one verse. I will pinpoint one title. Well, since you're talking about the 114 chapters of the Quran, I will focus on the 114 number. The number 114 and focus on chapter 57 that you just quoted. After chapter 57 is called the iron. The al oh, well, uh, Sorry, can you pick a different chapter? Because the idea is to get one for each chapter. And since we already have one for 57. Uh, what did you say about it? <laughs> we uh, said well, number 57. Uh, so you uh, yes. guess someone else already picked 57. Yeah, so the idea is that... We're picking one reason for each of the All chapters right. since he All put right. his reason on pick, 57. I will pick chapter 74, verse 31. No, no, that's not the one you want to pick. <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't you pick number 9 because it doesn't have the Bismillah? 
What was, what was that? The, uh, uh, number nine. It doesn't have a bismillah, right? So to you, that's uh, numeral. I mean, am I, am, I, am I picking something that I believe that is making thing, or you guys making something? Okay, okay. sorry, sorry. Yeah, I, I'm I, just I trying to help you out, but... Okay, go ahead, go ahead. Sorry. No, you, you can do 7431. That's fine by me. Chapter 74, verse 31. That's uh, Anam, by the way. The Trinitarian Muslim. Bro, you, you better not be a Trinitarian Muslim. Can't be a Muslim being a Trinitarian. Can't be a Muslim believing that Allah has a son, that there are three gods in one. That's not Islam, brother. It's man made. The Bible teaches Trinity. Even the Bible does not teach Trinity. But still, even if the Bible would have to teach Trinity, it's not from God. The Bible is here says, I demonstrated to you. You reading it. The book itself is telling you according to. The gospel according to. The gospel according to. What does it say? Don't you understand that? You got a PhD in religious, but you can't understand what the gospel according to means. You don't need to go to college to anywhere to know that the gospel according to means that according to this guy, here's what Jesus said. According to Mark, here's what Jesus had. According to Luke, here, that's here says. Come on now. You know better. It's telling you it's not sent to you. I am only sent even if the gospel, if the Bible was the real book of Jesus. It's telling you, I am not sent to you, brother. <laughs> You're insisting. The Quran is telling you, I am sent to you. The Bible is, sent, is telling you, I am not sent to you. And you want to hold into the Bible? Come on now. Come on, you know better. Uh, the verse 41 is a, is, a, is a conclusion of something that happened just right before it. Some people, like you guys, saying, oh, this Quran is nothing but man-made. It's just, it's just a human being made it. God really got mad at that person. He said, oh, so this you, you're saying that this Quran came from a human being? All right. I will show you now. 19 is going to show you that this is not from a human being. He said, Wama jalna illa malaika. He, he put an allegory, a, a beautiful allegory. Only angels are gardens of the hellfire. He said, Now, I made them some number, which is in uh, verse, the verse before 30. 19. Why I made them 19? Why I chose 19? Why not 100? Why not a million? Why I just choose 19 angels to guard the hellfire? The number 19. Why is it important? He gave five reasons. He said, one, fitantan lilladina kafaru. He said, to disturb the disbelievers, those who do not believe that the Quran is from God, that Islam is a religion, they will be, they, they will be amazed. I mean, they will be mad. They will be completely disturbed. Why? Because 19, the whole Quran is coded 19. Everything you said, 114 already, you said is 19 times 6. So if somebody had to change the Quran, he had to put it, he had to put either 114 less chapters or 114 more chapters. I mean to say 19 less or 19 more, multiples of 19. Just when it comes to the number of chapters. So anybody says hey, it's 111 or it's 116 or 118, it's not going to work. You need to add 19 more verses. That means all the Quran is going to be 90, uh, 133 uh, uh, chapters, I mean, uh, 19 more chapters, 133 chapters, or 95 chapters. So you can come up with your 111, 110, 108, 106. God said, hey, <laughs> it had to be multiple of 19. That's 114, 19 times 6. He said, uh, He said, to give certainty of the people of the book, now, people of the book, that's not the Christians, translated Christians and Jews, is the Nazarenes and the Jews. The word translated Christians, Nasara, that's not the Christians, and no Christians mentioned in neither in the Quran nor in the Bible. 
He said, uh, Where's that the Ladina Amanu Iman? I mean, that means that if those people see the miracle 19 in the Quran, Allah is used, the word Allah is used in the Quran 2698 times. It's 19 times 142. Just pick now the verses, just the verses, any verse. Any verse that contains the, the word Allah, put them to the numbers together. It's, it's uh, 100, 118, 1, 1, 2, 3. 1, 118,123. That's a multiple of 19. Just the placement of Allah inside the Quran. The number of times Allah in the Quran is, 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 is a multiple of 19. You think it's randomly just random? No. Allah used some numbers in the Quran. 30 numbers. You take them individually. Just each number once. Each number yeah, just okay, take okay. it once. We, we, we've got your miracle of 19. Okay. There we go. She's manifesting. She's choking. Listen now. <laughs> what you think it is. Can we, we, he's done this before. Do we have to sit there yeah, again yeah. every time? Please. See that? You're going to lose everyone. <laughs> you lose everyone. Every time. You lose everyone. He's grasping for air. Mary Harp, you're choking. Of course. That Eric needed to, to I, I sign know, off, but actually it looks like he already did. So Yeah, for Eric. I, um, I know you're choking, so... No, uh, so, so, sweetie, you understand how numbers work, right? So, I said, you know, okay, so how does a division, let me talk. Let me talk. so, hang on, I'm going to ask you a quick question. No, hello, so, questions are, I'm thinking, how, let me what talk. What percent of numbers are divisible by two? What is the purpose of asking me a question? I'm coming over here, they're telling me, pick any verse you want from the Quran, show us from that verse that the Quran can only be coming from Allah. One verse they need. How? That's BS already. How can you say, hey, just pick one verse? How? Can you do that from your Bible? No. But we can do it from the Quran. I picked one verse. I'm about to prove to you that the Quran is from Allah with chapter 74, verse 31. I, had, I did not even do one third of the verse. Not even one third. And I'm getting cut off. Because they're choking. Wallah. I said, uh, let me speak. I'm talking about two. I'm talking about 19, which is a yes, prime number. Yes, but we're talking, we're going to talk about numbers because it's important. Okay, how much, Please. what? Can I, can I proceed? What percent? No, you cannot proceed. You've already you given the speech. If you cannot much, explain the math, then it's what you're saying makes you. no sense. It's so too much. explain okay, to it's us. Too much for, it's too much for us. Okay, so your, your argument so is too much. Go away now. So then next time, yeah. don't let me go on your stream since you're going to interact. Sweetheart, you. sweetheart. Have That's you, what is the kind of mathematics that you have actually had? I'm just curious. I'm a ghost. Hang on. Hey, ultimate trade. Can I speak? Mary, Mary. 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 Mary, ultimate, one second, okay? Ultimate truth, it's supposed to be a discussion. You are allowed to talk for like five minutes. What discussion? It's supposed to be you exposing to us one verse of the Quran. That's your topic. Every single damn one coward, one of you is the Sunnis, the, the Shias, and the Christian doing the same thing. You asked me, pick one verse. I picked one. You said, no. Somebody picked some in here, in, in chapter uh, 57. Then uh, 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 Anam tried to make me pick something, uh, chapter 9. I said, no. Do I have to pick one verse? Yes. I'm picking 74 verse 31. <laughs> Why? In the hell? How can you try to justify your, do your wrongdoings, bro? That's ridiculous. That's before Mary said anything. And then yeah, she just wanted to words, ask bro. one simple I question. Go the Come on, man. No, you're not going through the verse. You're throwing yeah, you're out every, the everything you're that you... No, I'm not going through the verse. Who asked me to go through a verse? Oh, so are you asking me to quote just one half or one third or one fifth of the verse? You said picked any verse on, in any chapter besides chapter 57 and, and whatever. I picked chapter 74, verse 31. No, no, you can't. You see? You hear them, Christians? Thing is argument. evidence of your position. That's not going through the verse. Now, <laughs> would you please explain to me if something uh, is miraculous, what does that mean? Does that mean that it's likely or unlikely? I said, uh, 
you pick, you ask me for a verse. No, I pick the okay. verse. Okay, great, great. And you have it explained it. Thank you. You cannot give out your entire. Stop. Okay, we got your argument, Ultimate Truth. We understand your no, argument. No, no, not my argument. I told you to ask you some questions. You cut me off. I told you to cut me off. Man, get out of here, man. Go. What is the definition of a miracle? What is the definition? You're yeah. saying that this what is a miracle, so you need to explain to me what no, a miracle no is. From you, ultimate truth. We were trying to ask yes, you questions do. about your assertions. So, please. Oh my goodness! Be quiet. Allah <laughs> Truth has been muted. So here's how it's going to work. We are going, oh, well, he dropped. So I was going to say, well, I'll ask him a question and then he have an opportunity to answer the question. And if he tries, why would you ask me a question? You asked me to read a verse. I didn't finish the verse. And you want to ask me questions? You want me to tell you why do I believe that this verse is making the Quran come from Allah? I read one, maybe one third of the verse, maybe. Maybe one third of the verse, and you're telling me that you're gonna ask me questions because this this coward Mary Harb or whatever he, her name is is cutting me off because she's choking. Yes, said Pico just laughed at it. Everybody look at them. They all they all you know look at them uncomfortable. Shame on you Christians. That's what we do. That's what we do. Tries to get on something else then. We'll cut him off again, but he left on his own. Something so, else. Yeah. Oh, he's gonna do. His argument. I am reading chapter seventy-four or thirty-one. You said something else. What? What is it? Something else? He knows something else. Ask question on what? I am explaining to you. The, I mean, paragraph by paragraph of, of word by word, the chapter seventy-four, verse thirty-one. How do you expect? To have 114 callers, Muslim callers, for you to go through 114 chapters of the Quran during your life, you had to have 114 callers. That's how dumb you are, Tedeus. That's how BS you are, Tedeus. Every single time you do the same, coward. Run. Yeah. Yeah. You're All I was going to do ask him questions is about his argument. Yeah, I was going to ask him some questions about his argument, and then he could justify his argument, but he doesn't want to do that because he's frankly mathematically illiterate. So my question to him would have been, what makes a miracle? How unusual does something have to be to be miraculous? Is it a miracle if it happens one out of every two times? God have mercy upon us. <laughs> Don't run. Run. Total number is large enough to start, right? You will end up with a hit. And if you only assemble, and then 18 out of 19 times, you will not end up with a hit. <laughs> but it's still one out of nineteen. She's how she's so dumb. She's talking about two, and we're talking about nineteen, a prime number. We're talking about everything in the Quran, every single word, every single chapter, every single verse.
every single expression like Allah wahdahu, like la ilaha illallah, like uh, uh, anything. Every letter is coded 19. There's 1,000, is that it? 1,263, I believe, or 67. I think it's 1,273, I believe. 1,273, letter ta. The letter ta is 1,273 times in the Quran. Listen to that now. It's a multiple life, you know, of course. The middle one, there's a chapter called chapter Taha. Ta, one chapter called Ta, starting with Taha. The Taha of the chapter Taha is in the middle of the 1,273 times the letter Ta in the Quran. <laughs> you dummies. You can't handle the truth. So get out of here. Of course, they banned me. I mean, they, they, hey, they cut me off. I nobody's going to say that one out of 19 is a miracle. Bye-bye. it's not. Somebody said. If you are trying a certain number of things, it's like winning the lottery, even. Winning the lottery is not a miracle when someone wins a lot, lot, lottery. Somebody's going to win it, right? Not a miracle. It's the lottery. It's odds. And so Somebody whenever said something. you are constantly throwing things at the wall and Somebody said, you Mary, know, you you're going to speak after two, don't times, give a damn about what you're saying. you cut everything else out and you present you your know, bullseye in front of everyone go, ah, you must believe somebody me. Said, perfect and this is a miracle. No, it's truth, don't care what you say. That one out of 19 things that you try. He, he exposed you. Is going That's to the work. bottom line. It's not only that, but I they see that comment. the text to make more things work that otherwise of course don't accept me ever again you can come up with all kinds of silly miracles using the bible using moby dick it's using a miracle Shakespeare, that using whatever any person like. believe the number because 19 it's argument it's not a miracle it's just going to happen it is an inev inevitability it is the opposite of a miracle it's guaranteed that one out of something mary help you are saying doesn't so, what are you saying doesn't matter to ultimate truth miracle, it just expose you, you. Really yes pills and that's what that's pills for your wokeness i expose her that's what i'm talking about one out of 19 things are so true. that's you know, it you're gonna go any longer any further i expose them day one they choked too so they be choking over and over and over I and know. over again uh, they oh. all will be choking Without any exception. Yes, ultimate mathematics. This guy is saying he's a mathematician. I'm bringing him mathematic proof that the Quran is from God and he's running. Coward, Tedewus. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah wa barakatuh. I don't want peace. I want problems always. <laughs> God have mercy upon us. 